What is up guys, Zach Scott here playing Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. This is Eterna City. History living here. Uh, let's have some fun in this episode. What do you guys say? And thank you for all the likes in the previous episode. I really do appreciate it every time you like this video. It feels great riding a bike with a win in your face, doesn't it? I wouldn't know. I don't have a bike yet. Why does he think I have a bike? Anyway, what's up? Hey, you. Yeah, you, trainer. Er, it's okay. Never mind. You look tough. I won't take... Uh, I'll just let you keep your Pokemon. Carry on. Yeah, that's right. You thought you could... You thought you could mess with me, but you can't. I'm gonna heal my Pokemon, although I don't know if they need to be healed. Uh, let's see. Hello and welcome to the Pokemon Center. We, yeah. Yeah, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Okay. So yeah, thank you so much for your support on the series. I mean, I really, really do appreciate it. Also, a lot of new subscribers have been picked up. Uh, so if you haven't subscribed yet, now is your chance. I mean, it's your last chance. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Subscribe any time, but please do so. Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. Excellent. We hope to see you again and again. You left over 8,000 likes in the first episode. It has a quarter million views. Thank you. Hi, you cute little trainer. What kinds of Pokemon are with you? This Pokeetch <laughs> Poke app will show you how close your Pokemon feel to you. All right, friendship checker. Cool. I don't care. Your friendship checker app identifies the Pokemon that, that like you. I don't care who likes me. I'm in it for myself. Team Galactic took my Pokemon away. They took other people's too. Something should be done, but Team Galactic creeps everyone out. What are they doing to my Pokemon? We'll find out, maybe. When a Pokemon faints, use a revive on the Pokemon. It'll be able to battle again. Okay. So, I don't really want to go up or down. I'm out of here. This place does not have a second floor. <laughs> uh, sup, dude. My friend said Team Galactic took his favorite Pokemon away. I don't think he's telling the truth. Team Galactic looks cool. They don't look like the common ruffians. Trust me, they're ruffians, dude. Common at that. Eternus City is not anything like it was before, way back in the day. They say this is an old city. It doesn't look it, though. Not with all these tall buildings. These buildings are not that tall. <laughs> these Whoever made this game doesn't quite understand building size. <laughs> Who's this? Oh, is that a Pokédex? You must be helping Professor Rowan. What's your name? Okay, hello, Z-Dog. I'll be sure to remember that name. My name is Cynthia. I'm a trainer just like you. I've been studying Pokemon mythology lately just out of curiosity. Here in Eternus City, there's a statue of an ancient Pokemon. According to myth, it was an extremely powerful Pokemon. Who knows? You may encounter something like it while, you were, while you're traveling with your Pokedex. Try using these. They should help you on your way. TM93s. I like how she's giving me multiples. Cut. In the hidden oh, cut in the hidden moves app allows you to chop down small trees that are blocking your way. Remember, you can use the hidden move cut from your Poke Etch in the field. It will let you go places that were previously inaccessible to you. That's important for filling up your Pokédex, right? Then luck be with you, young trainer. Thank you, Cynthia. Was that your name? I don't even remember. I think it was Cynthia. So now I can cut this. Cut it down with a hidden move. Do it then. Uh, do I actually have to? Okay. Uh, there it is. Wait, do I not know it yet? Hold on. Oh, okay, there we go. No, what? Wait, 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 what? Uh, okay. Let me take a look at my... Uh, maybe I gotta teach a Pokemon it? Does someone know Rock Smash, though? Where's the moves? There we go. How do I learn cut? No one on my team knows Rock Smash, but suddenly, like, I'm. Z I'm super confused. Do I just not know it yet? Has no one taught me it? Okay, let's just move. Let's move forward. I'm back. There's a bike. Can I steal a bike? I think I gotta rent them. The Grand Underground sure is massive. You're gonna be. You're gonna have a blast down there. I don't know about that. I am the first one to have started digging out of the Grand Underground. I am. You can call me the Underground Man. So everyone else does. I'll make a gift of this to you. You hold up your end of the deal and you and put it to good use. The Explorer Kit. Nice. What does that do? Use the Explorer Kit from your bag's key items to pocket to visit the Grand Underground. 
Let me mentor you as you become a full-fledged spelunker. Just follow my lead. Okay. I think there's one guy I didn't get to talk to, but okay. First, go to the Grand Underground. Going underground is quite easy. Simply use your Explorer Kit. It can't be used indoors or in a cave. Now give it a try. Okay. Th it's using... Oh my gosh. Really? Oh, wow. Hey, Z Dog. This is your first time here? Welcome to Sinnoh's Grand Underground. This is a network of tunnels, caves, and caverns lying beneath Sinnoh. This is Rourke. Huh? What am I doing in this expanse of a place? That's kind of hard to answer. I mean, you can do pretty much anything you want down here. You mean there's like no laws? This is like the purge? For instance, you can dig up fossils and treasure, or you can make your own secret base. You should talk to the underground man in Eterna City to learn more. Why is the way to go back to the surface? Remember, why? I have to get going now. I'll see you around. Okay. <laughs> what? what? Am I doing down here? Are there random encounters? There's orange, something orange. Uh, yeah. Oh. There is a note tucked inside the Explorer Kit. Digging for fossils. I put a sledgehammer and pickaxe in your Explorer Kit. Use them and you'll be able to dig out all sorts of stuff from the walls. Before the wall comes tumbling down, that is. I'm sure you can do it. Good luck, youngster. Something pinged on the wall. Too confirmed. What the heck? the heck is going on? What the heck? Oh, is multiple layers? What the heck is going on here? Oh. All right, I got this, I think. What the heck? What? The wall collapsed. Did I get anything? I did, okay. You obtained a pretty stone box. The stone box started to shine. Oh wow, it's a be beautiful statue appeared. Is that a statue or a fossil? All right. I'm in the Grand Underground. What the heck is going on here? What? Fountain Spring Cave? What is this place? Oh, we're bat. Okay, I didn't think we'd be battling. Hello, you encountered a wild Gastrodon. See, I prefer encounters like this. I don't like random encounters. Oh wow, he's actually pretty pretty powerful. Flame wheel. Actually, what is he? Is he a water? Yeah, that wasn't very effective, right? Oof, I'm gonna maybe get hurt really bad here. I'm assuming, let's see, Gastrodon. Let's see, Gastrodon is a, is he's a water ground, right? Water ground, so let me pull up my Pokemon type chart. And uh, let's see. So a water ground. A water would be weak to electricity and grass. Ground would be weak to water, grass, and ice. I don't think I have any grass attacks at all. Oof. Uh, let's just do my fighting move then. Actually, I should probably switch out because I will be weak to water. Uh. Oof, so water, I don't really have anything. I just need to probably switch types. Like maybe let's let's go to Machop over here. Might be my best choice. Because if he has to use water, I'm, I'm pretty much gone. I feel like I'm, I'm totally derailed. I didn't know I was coming down here. Ancient power. Ow. All right, not very effective though, so how about that? 
Knock off. Hold on, which one which one are these? Knock off. Low sweep. Okay. So I, I want to get him weak enough to uh what's wait, what's curse do? Is he cursing himself? Why? Oh, but something else happened. Oh, his attack rose. And defense. Uh, let's do revenge, maybe? He's using curse again. Oh, boy. Um, so his speed's going to be down, but he's still going faster than me. That was so weak. My goodness, I don't know if I can beat this guy. Oh my gosh. Ancient power. Now this hurt me a bit more. It's the revenge again in case, oh, water ball. Here comes a water move. Jeez Louise, dude, I'm almost dead. All right, let's just see if we can capture him now. Maybe a great ball. Like I want, I want to be sure to capture him. I don't know if it will. Dang it! I'm gonna get hit now. Yep. The chop faints. Oof. Not very effective, but I still fainted. This thing's a little tough, huh? Uh, use the next Pokemon. Maybe we can bring out Staravia. Staravia. Stay Ravia. Uh, let's hit him with a wing attack or a quick attack. Let's see how this goes. Okay. Oh man, okay, hopefully I can get the, get him captured this time. Let's try my other great ball. I'll have to get some more of these eventually. Let's see, please stay, dang it, are you kidding me? H how many of my Pokemon are gonna faint? Don't worry, I'll go heal. Uh, next. I mean, I dog is so susceptible. Let's try. Uh, let's try Onyx. Hello. Dragon Breath. Barely anything. Oh, but he might be paralyzed. I love it. He's gonna recover. No, don't recover. What the? Are you kidding me? What the heck, dude? This is nothing. I just need to retreat or something. No, he's recovered. This is battle is pointless. He just keeps getting better. Oh my god, run. Can I run? I, I'm a, I, that was a waste of time, dude. He's still there, right? He's not, well, there's another one there. Let me go up. Go up. Yes. So, I found a statue. I don't know what the heck the statues are for. Aha, uh -huh, I see you've gone underground. Well done, take this as a reward. A red sphere S, a blue sphere S, green sphere S. There are apparently some Pokemon in the Grand Underground that you can't normally find around here. Meeting a new Pokemon is 100 times more fun when it's a rare one. Your road to being a Spelunker has barely begun. If you want to know more, just visit me. Okay, I want to talk to the other guy who was in your house. What the heck? Let's dig up some treasure. I'm from Orberg. I work at the mining museum. I've got advice from the underground man on digging up fossils and spheres. Before I get digging, let me share his advice with you. While you're digging, you may uncover dark rocks. They are very hard. If you keep hitting them, the wall will collapse. Keep that in mind and you'll be digging up treasure in no time. Okay, so that's that's what I probably why it collapsed, because I probably hit those too many times. 
Let's heal my Pokemon before going anywhere else. Where's my cut move? How do I... Anyway. Okay, clear. Thank you for waiting. All right. Um, where where were my TMs? There's Rock Smash. It's a fighting. Oh, it's a fighting move. Maybe I do have Rock Smash. There's Cut. Now hold on. No one has Rock Smash, so I don't think I have to teach it to anybody. I'm a little confused how come I can't just use the cut move, you know what I mean? I don't understand how to actually get cut to... Can I have a bike? No. Hmm. Sup? Welcome to the herb shop, home of effective yet inexpensive medicine. I mean, uh, sure, what do you have here? Healing powder? Right now. No, I'm good. I'm good. Do come again. Herbal meds work most impressively, but your Pokemon won't like them. They're horribly bitter and smelly. Well, then I'm not going to give them to them. Someone ought to invent herbal medicine that isn't bitter. That would be a medical breakthrough. You can just take it in like a capsule. You don't even sm taste it, you know? Have you ever thought of that? Or is it just me? I thought of it. I'm the inventor now of capsules in this world. Uh, hold on. I'm not done searching over here. And I don't think I'm done with the underground either. Excuse me. If I could just walk straight. Did I go in here yet? I don't know. Gosh, dang it. What the heck? Can't even walk straight. Tell me I can just buy a bike here. What's up? The manager's gone off to, to the Team Galactic building and hasn't returned. I wonder what's holding him up. Oh, I don't know. I don't want to know. Sup? They say this is an old city. Oh, yeah. You already said that. Sup? Since that Team Galactic building went up, the city's atmosphere has gotten all creepy and tense. I don't know what those people are doing up in that place. I don't either, and I don't know how to use cut. Up. Let me tell you something. I got into a bad situation in Eternal Forest. From now on, I'm going. I'm not going anywhere without an escape rope. If you get more gym badges, the Pokemarts will offer you more items. Can I buy any more Great Balls? Because I feel like I need some more Great Balls. There's just Poke. I don't have. I just wasted my Great Balls. No. All right, what's this building here? Sup? Hello, hello, I am the official name raider. Want me to rate the nicknames of your Pokemon? Yes. Which Pokemon's nickname should I critique? Uh, iDogs. iDog has the best name. Uh, select him. iDog, is it? That's a decent nickname. But would you like to give it an even better name? How about it? No. I see, please come visit again. Excuse me, but do you got that Pokemon name, Boizel? Want to trade it for my chat rot? I don't have a Boizel, but I'll try to keep in mind that if I ever see a Boizel, that guy will trade it. Hi, I'm the building superintendent. I maintain a vigilant 24-hour watch. Well, good job, dude. Hope you don't need any sleep. Gardenia, our gym leader, goes out to Eternia Forest every so often. I'm always, I always wonder what she does there. Excuse me. I've had these TMs for the move recycle for such a long time now. There's not they're not anything I have much use for these days. I do hope you're you put them to good use, young trainer. Good. Alright, uh let's get a move on. There are some sparkling stones lying around in the Grand Underground. I gathered up a lot of stickers, so I'm placing them on my ball capsules. 
th I'm this close to being ready for the super contest shows in her in Heart Home City. Hooray, my secret base has got another great. What? Badges from gyms or wins in super contest shows. There's much more. There, there's more than just one way to be a winner. It seems. Here's hoping you'll find something in which you can be the victor. I'm thinking. You know, I'm, I'm doing pretty good in views. Thanks to yous. i will watch my videos. I appreciate it. That's how I'm a winner. That's how I win. <laughs> All right. Eterna City again. Uh. All right. What's up? Since you're visiting Eterna, you need to get yourself a bike and take a ride down Cycling Road. That would be nice. It sounds nice. I do feel like I need a bike. This place is empty. Good. Let's go. Hope there's nothing I... Wait, let me search the place. Maybe I could be a thief. What do you guys think? Do you think it's a good idea to be a thief? Doesn't seem like it... Crime doesn't pay. Oh, well. I tried to be a thief. All right, well, uh, what's this? Is this a gym? Hey there, how's it going, champ to be? Actually, that's what the, I said to some boy who zipped in here earlier too. The gym leader, Gardenia, is a user of grass-type Pokemon. It should be obvious, but grass-type Pokemon really hate fire. Oh, wait a second, I should tell you about the gym itself first. You can't challenge the gym leader until you find and beat all the gym's trainers who've hidden themselves. It's a bit challenging, but just think of it as a good training and go for it. Are you a trainer? At my gym, no one gets to battle with the gym leader, me, until they've beaten all the other trainers. I'll be waiting for you in the back. Good luck, challenger. Oh, wait, where where are the trainers? Oh, wow. Okay. I bet they're in here. <laughs> I bet they are. Uh... Is it a maze? Okay. They do seem to have hidden themselves quite well. So far. Really, there's no one behind here? Huh. No one over here either? Where the heck are they? How did you know where to find me? Let's have our battle. Okay, I found one person. All right, you're challenged by last Caroline. Send out Cherubi. This should be an easy gym for me because I dog's fire based. Of course. Uh, let's do flame wheel. It's gonna drive over all these clowns. Boom! Desolated. Destroyed. Destruction assured. All right. Machop leveled up. Is Machop, what can I say, scary face? Uh, what, what does scary face do? It's a normal move. Uh, it just lowers your speed. Harshly land critical hits or make them really slow This already lowers the speed so I don't know let's just forget scary face Yeah, give up Machop did not learn scary face here comes Roselia keep the current Pokemon. Let's fight it out uh, Flame wheel let's do it Boom! Super effective. All right, gotcha. Now I gotta go find, I, I guess there are probably two more, I, I would guess. I was going to beat you while you were still in a state of shock. I was never in a state of shock. What are you talking about, girl? Okay, the next trainer's at the end, past the two boulders, I think. It's like a Squid Game style room. She wasn't that hard to find, so. My grass type Pokemon can dole out some serious special attacks. I won't let you win easily. I don't think, I don't think it's gonna matter. 
There's another aroma lady. Badoo! All right, so the beauty of this is that I'm just able to just fry up any of these plants that I want to. Sauteed style. Ember coming out. And that was enough. Super effective, critical hit. I actually landed a critical hit, that's why, but. Oh, nice, M-Dog is level 19. Uh, keep thinking, Badoo's coming out again. And then another Ember. Let's try another Ember. See if this is enough. Excellent. All right. And then uh, another Badoo. Uh, just why would I switch? This is working out great. This was level 15. Maybe I'll maybe I'll ramp it up a little bit with a flame wheel. These are all Badoos of various levels, but they're all gone. Po what? He poisoned me? What? What? Are you joking? Kidding me? You poison me before you die? All right. Take that, Jenna. The more beautiful a flower, the faster it withers. Okay. Oh, that's right, a hint about the next trainer. In the middle of the three trees, that's that's it for my hint, good luck. So, I need, I might need like an antidote for this poison, right? Do I have to teach a Pokemon cut to use the cut move? Antidote on iDog here. He's been cured. Middle of trees. I mean, here's some trees here, right? Thankfully, there are no random encounters in here. Oh, there, there. I, no, I, saw, I went over there before. You weren't there. Even when you try to conceal it, you can't hide the aroma of flowers. Is this another aroma lady? The aroma ladies are creepy. She only has one. It better be good. Turtwig. Remember, like, turdwig. All right, here we go, I dog. You're just gonna roll over him. With the flame wheel again. Boom! Super effective. All right. J-Dog leveled up. And she's down for the count. Just like your inability to conceal your abundant skill. I just can't help it, I have to show off sometimes. Besides four flowers, okay. I see you're up here already. I think they just they keep spawning in. I guess I had to do it in a certain order. Giggle, you found me. Of course I'll battle you. All right, nothing to laugh about. Beauty, Lindsay. What a beautiful beauty. Roselia. How many do you have? One or two? I didn't look. All right, here we go. I know you got this. Flame wheel again, Jillian had one. Burning them. All right, adios. And Beauty Lindsay has been defeated. Ah, boo, Looks, look, you've beaten me. I did, I did beat you. You're welcome. There's only our gym leader left, go on. Don't be afraid. I'm not afraid. All right, let's go up here. What is up? You kept me waiting. I am Eternus Gym Leader Gardenia, the Grass-type Master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you'd find your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So anyway, this will be fun. Let's have our battle. Let's do it. All right. You are challenged by Gym Leader Gardenia. Gym Leader Gardenia sent out Cherubi. And I, of course, have Eye Dog, who's just gonna tear everything up. 
for real. For real, flame wheel each and every time basically is my, my strategy. I don't think it's gonna be much more effort than this. Fainted goodbye. Goodbye to you. Who's next? Turtwig, I already fought a Turtwig. But there's another one. Uh, Flame Wheel gets to go off again at the start. And Turtwig is gone. Super effective. I'm not having any problems here in this gym yet. Onyx leveled up, nice. Uh, Ro Roserade. Roserade. Uh, let's keep the. Po I don't know what Roserade is, but I'm a little worried. It's not the end yet. Oh, but it will be very soon for you. Here's Roserade. And uh, looking pretty good. I'm gonna do a flame wheel. I'm assuming you're gonna be susceptible to this. But she's gonna use Grass Knot right off the bat. Don't get me out. Ow. Oh, that was actually pretty good. Even though it says it's not very effective, that was a pretty good hit. Here comes Flame Wheel. Ooh, almost got her. What is this? Don't eat that. Okay, great. So she heals a little bit. That's okay. The next flame wheel will destroy her. Are you saying something? You think you have me cornered? Yeah, I think you're gone, dude. After one more flame wheel. But she's going to do another grass knot, which is going to hurt me, but it's not going to be the end of me. Here comes flame wheel. All right. It's super effective. The opposing Roserade fainted. Great. All right. Nice. Everyone, pretty much everyone leveled up. Saravia. J Dog again. Machop. And M Dog again. Perfect. And Baton Pass. All right, Gym Leader Gardenia. She's happy. Amazing. You're very good, aren't you? I am very good. Thank you for noticing. How did you notice? I might have said it before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? I guess it's a measure of how much you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I proudly grant, grant you this. There you go. Another gym badge for me. The forest badge from Gardenia. Excellent. With the forest badge, the hidden move cut will be available. Oh, finally. Now that you have two gym badges, all Pokemon you received in trades will obey you up to level 30. I've also got something else for you. There are th These are a gift for me. The stickers that Gardenia uses. Okay, I still don't know how the sticker things work, but I'll take the TMs. And I put them in my pocket. The heavier the, po the opposing Pokemon, the more damage the move will cause. That was Grass Knot. So thank you, thank you. Uh, let's continue looking around outside. Maybe I'll run into someone or something, or I don't know. Maybe get my bike on, you know what I mean? You turn a city. Already been here. Maybe I should rest my Pokemon, I don't know. I can now cut uh, that out off the building there. I know that I dog took a little bit of a beating during that fight, but it's okay. And then, uh, and we're off. Let's take a look at these trees. Cut it. Badoof is doing the cutting too. All right, let's see what's going on in this building here. I don't know what to expect. Oh wow, it's Team Galactic isn't interested in the world. Our gaze is beyond the stars. Welcome to Team Galactic. Are you here to donate your Pokemon? What, you're not? Then kindly get off our property. Do we have to bring the pain like we did with the Cycle Shop Manager? Sorry, dearie. Team Galactic doesn't accept children as members. Oh, well, that's fine. I'm not here to join up. I'm here to fight, I guess. Uh, what do they have? Zubat, okay. Don't care about Zubat. He's only level 14. Let's do another flame wheel. Let's just keep hitting with flame wheel all day, every day. Got him. What can I say? 
Who's next? Another Zubat? No, Glameow. Let's keep the current Pokemon, I suppose. I don't really know what Glameow is. Is it the, a cat thing? Yeah, okay, I know what that is. Oh, wait, no, I should have... Dang it, whatever. I should have done Power of Punch, but this will do. Yeah, that did just fine. Alright, so no kids allowed, but I'm here. What say you? But, but dearie, you're just a kid. Heck yeah. What's up? We are gathering Pokemon for an astonishing undertaking. Your meddling won't be tolerated. All right, up to you. Another two. Who do you got? Who's first? Wormple. All right, sure. Uh, yeah, Flame Wheel's gonna be super effective. I'm, I'm just curious what's going on upstairs. These are all really easy. I'm glad I got that gym badge out of the way pretty quickly. Keep the current Pokemon for Cascoon. Flame Wheel coming through. Goodbye, good riddance. Cascoon fainted. All right, I mean, hey dude, you stood in my way. I feel like I got meddled with. <laughs> You've been meddled with. Feel the pain. Okay, what's up here? More guys to fight, probably. Team Galactic is working hard to find new energy sources for the future. Our objectives are incredible, too incredible for me to understand. I'll fight blindly to defend them and your intrusion won't be forgiven. All right, some want to fight, some don't. That's okay, I'll take on anyone who wants to. What is he sending out? Wormple again, well, feel the flames. Get singed. There you go. Eye dogs here. Battle flame wheel. Let's do it. Got him. All right. Zubat. Uh, just keep the current Pokemon. We're doing great with the flame wheel. Like I, I feel like a broken record just doing the same move over and over. Right? Is that what it's like? I don't know. But flame wheel, sure. If it works, just do it. That's my philosophy. Just keep sweeping the legs in Mortal Kombat. <laughs> All right. What was I fighting for again? You got swept up in an ideology you know nothing about, and you can't even defend it. Let's do it. Dang it, let's see how good this Pokemon is. I stole it from some weak trainer. That was very criminal of you. It's only one, though. Silcoon. I'm just beating up with these Pokemon that are owned by other people. I hope that they don't mind. Flame Wheel. Uh, sure. Let's hit him. Got him. Super effective. All right. What is this? Oh, you want to fight too? We're conducting research on new forms of energy. We want to harness the mysterious power of Pokemon. All right, going up to the top floor then. Anything over here? How many floors are there? Why, thank you. We love it when people come to us to donate their Pokemon. That's not what we're doing. Not at all. All right, three Pokemon this time. Wurmple. Why do they all gotta have the same Pokemon? I guess if they took them from everyone in this town, maybe they're just partial. Flame wheel again. Get ready for it. Hit it. Got it. Hit it, got it good. Wurmple fainted. Onyx leveled up. He wants to learn Rock Slide. Let's figure out if that's what he would, what would be good for him. So it's a rock move, of course. 75-90. Uh, maybe I'll replace Bind. 
I'm not a huge fan of Bind, so there it goes. All right, Silcoon, just uh, keep keep the same. You're going down, Silcoon. Flame wheeling it. Straight dealing it, the pain. All right. <laughs> Sometimes this game feels a little too easy, but that's all right. Zubat, just keep, I mean, everything gets flame wheeled right now. It's just ridiculous. They send out these really weak Pokemon. What is the deal? This guy's only level 12. Got him though. And I imagine I won't get much of XP for that, but that's okay. All right. What do you think you're doing? All right, that's okay, that's okay. Ordinary people like you can't understand Team Galactic's grand designs. Come to think of it, I don't even know what's going on. Hey, Doc. Our mission is to implement our operations without question. It is all for the New World Order that our boss will lead. Is your boss upstairs? Am I gonna get to the boss and then... Sounds like Scientist Trevon. He's got Kadabra. Ugh, okay. At least he has a good Pokemon, I think. Uh, let's do Power Up Punch. No, I dang it, no, that went back. That worked. Kinesis. What was this? Ah, uh, is it going speed? No, my accuracy. Let's do a Power Up Punch. There you go. That was accurate. No, it wasn't very effective, but it still won the round for me pretty quickly. Three leveled up. Wow, Staravia, M, M Dog, and you've been defeated, Scientist Travon. This won't go unpunished. I'm gonna go upstairs. That's what I'm gonna do, Travon, and I'm gonna see what's up there and see who who this is. Hello, who's this? What is it with t this Team Galactic? Why do they take our Pokemon? What are they trying to accomplish? Who's this? Commander, ah, uh, did you want something? How silly of me to even ask. You want me to, you want to free the Pokemon? Yeah, that's gonna happen. All right, here's Commander, Commander who? All right, you were challenged by Commander Jupiter. Commander Jupiter sent out Zubat. So this is another Commander that I'm fighting here. Kind of getting like two major things done in one episode. That's pretty cool. Flame wheel. Boom. All right, Machop leveled up. Uh, skunk tank. Uh, just keep. I don't know what skunk tank is. Is a skunk? It's a tank. How insolent. Take a bite of this, child. Get some more fire in your life. All right, not, that's not bad. Poison gas, but I avoided it. Love it. Let's try power punch. All right, not the best, but whatever. Try another flame wheel after this. Dang it. I'll do another power punch. Uh, point another point. I did not miss this poison gas. I'm gonna get poisoned probably That's okay. Poison doesn't do that much damage immediately. It does damage over time Battle power up punch hit him One more of those would be good. I'm pretty sure unless he takes another berry. I don't think he's gonna have another berry Here comes snarl Yeah, dude, you're going down dude I'm, I feel like I'm going down, but... Ouch. Let's do the power punch, see if, see if this ends him. I hope it does. Yes, goodbye skunk tank. Aftermath, what's the aftermath? I was hurt by something. What was I, what was I hurt by? The aftermath of that? All right, there you go, and J-Dog leveled up. I defeated Commander Jupiter. 
Losing to some child, being careless cost me too much. Doesn't cost you anything to lose to me. Well, aren't you tough? It's okay though, our official Pokemon statue investigation is finished and Mars has collected energy from the Valley Windworks. We're pretty much finished here. I'll let you in on one little thing. Our boss is researching the myths of, of ancient Pokemon. With the power of mythical Pokemon, he will become the ruler of Sinnoh. I suggest you keep out of Team Galactic's affairs from now on. This is your last warning. I got my Clefairy back and it's all thanks to you, but that Team Galactic, they said Clefairy came from space, handed over. Their logic baffles me still. It's like they are from space. Anyway, they're, they're gone now. Thank you very much. I can't thank you enough right now, but cruise by my cycle shop, okay? I will do that. I will do just that. Let's cruise by the cycle shop and hopefully get a cycle in preparation for next episode to cycle to wherever I need to go. I forgot where it was already, the name of it. But we'll figure it out. And then, uh, out of here. Oh yeah, this is blocking me. Chop, 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 chop it down. Thank you. No sound effect, none needed. Hey, let's heal my guys again. You know. Just because. All right, and then this whole underground stuff I'm not familiar with. Yeah, let me know what to do about that underground. Like, how much time should I spend down there? You know? Let me know in the comments below. Where's this? Is the cycle shop down here? Was this it? No, this was the gym. My bad. Cycle shop was. Was this it? I don't remember what the cycle shop looked like. <laughs> uh, was this it? How can you tell what a cycle shop looks like? Oh wait, there were cycles in front of it, right? Maybe that is a big clue. I don't know, let me take a look. This could be the cycle shop. All right. Thanks for rescuing me. I can't thank you enough. Say, let me give you a bike to show my gratitude. Please come with me for a moment. And hey, which bike you got for me, huh? Oh, we're going to one outside. I like you to choose a color for your bike. Which one will it be? Let's go with green. You want a green bike? Sure. Marvelous, you've chosen a fresh and lively green. It's somewhat reminiscent of the seed of, of, on Bulbasaur's back. It's perfect for you. You obtain the bike. You put the bike in your bags. Keep, I just put it in my bag, huh? It's the latest model, so I'll read the operating manual to you. Press the B button to shift gears, it says. In third gear, this bike cannot reach full speed, but it'll be easier to handle. In fourth gear, it can ride at full speed and climb up slopes. Your bike can take you through all sorts of towns, roads, and routes. Now get out there and ride. Thanks, dude. I'm looking pretty fancy here. Press B to speed up or improve control. Whoa. Oh, wow, you got a bike. You can ride down Cycling Road and end up in, in Hard Home City. It's a fast and fun ride. You should check it out. I'm just practicing, you know what I mean? This one's fast. Oh, wow. How do I, how do I stop riding the bike? Hold on. How do I disengage from the bike? Oh my gosh. Go back. How do I stop riding my bike? I don't know how to stop riding the bike. I don't know how to close this. There we go. Uh, I mean, I guess I could just stay on the bike. What's up, kid? They say this is a Pokemon that lived long, long ago. Is that true, though? Maybe it's still alive. Oh, wow, yeah. There is some riding on the Pokemon statue. 
Dia, once created, brought time into being. In laughter or in tears, the same time flows. Such is the blessing of Dia. The text is barely legible and is faded completely in places. All right. I don't, I don't, okay. Eterna came back, uh, came to be long ago in honor of an ancient Pokemon. Though many things have changed, what is important has not. I hope it remains that way forevermore. Have you seen the Pokemon statue? When I was a wee child, it used to be the centerpiece of many festivals. Yeah, I saw it. I saw it was cool. Uh... Did I go in here yet? I feel like I have. I think I have. Yeah, I have. Yeah, yeah. This is the herbal shop. So, uh, you know, next episode we'll figure out which way to go. Uh, I'm sure there's plenty of options. There's a Pokeball like way back there somehow. Oh, I see. I cut. Here we go. I'm gonna cut this one. And then I'm gonna go all the way in the back. Cut another. Then let's. Uh, can I go this way? No. If I can go this way. Thief! Maybe I'm a thief for taking this, huh? But anyway, I do really appreciate you guys watching, liking, subscribing, all of that stuff. Uh, I'm curious what's over. It's over here. Turn a city. This is round 211. So I'll figure out which way to go, and then uh, next episode I will be back. Goodbye, and thank you for watching. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.